The origin of the paper really comes from the fact that I've been working on something called the demographic transition for a long time. And looking at the implications of this phenomena for social development, different aspects of societal development essentially. And uh, clearly one aspect of uh, change in the world over the last 150, 200 years has been uh, the emergence of democracy. And so that was one of the things that we, um, we decided we'd, we'd look at. Now, I looked at it first and foremost looking at the experience of European countries in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. And it appeared that uh, demographic change was by far the most important explanation for uh, the rise of democracy, particularly in Western Europe, but also in the United States. And so Ben and I decided that we would look at this using more recent data. So we looked at the period between 1970 and about 2005. And our aim was essentially to gauge the degree to which demographic change um, had, uh, was responsible for or had contributed to um, the growth of democracy in the, uh, in the modern world. And uh, we found that it was indeed um, as important as any other factor. The only other factor that was as important was the, the, the rise of education. There is absolutely no doubt, uh, looking at the next 25, uh, 50 years, that um, mortality rates will continue to improve in general, that fertility rates will continue to come down and population growth rates will reduce. And related to those developments, populations will become older, uh, su substantially older. And in general, um, I believe that those processes will help facilitate democratization. Going through this demographic transition, this process, uh, this move towards low birth and death rates, doesn't guarantee democracy. And you can look at a number of countries in the world today that have gone through the demographic transition and have not become democratic. Uh, Belarus, um, uh, Russia, for example, um, Cuba, China is approaching the end of the demographic transition. Um, but give it time. Give it time.